In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen, dearly beloved in Christ, and Father, Emmanuel, Awea. And all I share with you, a touch of God's love, does a short of election and prayer on the Holy Mass readings of Sunday, 12 November 2023. The readings are taken from Wisdom 6, 12 to 16, Psalm 62, 2 to 8, 1 Thessalonians 4, 13 to 18, and Matthew 25. 1 to 13. The theme of the reflection is how to find wisdom. How to find wisdom. The first reading says, Wisdom is bright and does not grow dim. By those who love her, she is readily seen and found by those who look for her. Quick to anticipate those who desire her, she makes herself known to them. Watch for her early and you will have no trouble. Uh, you will find her sitting at your gates. Even to think about her is understanding fully grown. Be on the alert for her, and anxiety will quickly leave you. She herself walks about looking for those who are worthy of her, and graciously shows herself to them as they go in, in every thought of this coming to meet them. Beloved, the text shows three things. First, that wisdom has a divine nature, since it is only God who is unchanging. Thus, God is the source of wisdom, and we can find wisdom only from God. Secondly, to find wisdom, we have to search, praying and meditating every morning. Three, he deserves to live in us. Uh, wisdom desires, wisdom desires, wisdom which God himself desires to live in us and thus quickly comes to those worthy of her. That is why the psalm says, For you my soul is testing, oh my God, my soul is testing for you like a dry weary land without water. The gospel teaches us how to, to search, to search for God's wisdom. It gives us the parable of the five foolish and five wise virgins. The difference between them is that the wise virgins had extra oil, while the foolish virgins, virgins did not have. As a result, as a result, the foolish ones could not participate in the banquets. This implies that to participate in the wisdom of God, we need extra human wisdom. We need extra wisdom, which is zeal. We need zeal. In other words, to participate in wisdom, we have to zealously meditate on His will and beg for the grace to carry out His will and try to do it with all our strength. Mediocrity cannot help us to participate in God's wisdom. We need zeal, a lot of zeal. God's wisdom is a banquet because it fills people with joy, it fills us with joy. Finally, the second reading teaches us how to the second reading also teaches us how to search. It is by dying in Christ so as to rise with him. Dying in Christ means crucifying our will so that we will cease to exist and only Christ will exist in us. The more we try to do this, the more we grow in wisdom and grace. So the search for wisdom is not only through prayer and meditation, but also acting in righteousness, acting in the will of God, dying to ourselves and living in Christ. Dearly beloved, in the name of Jesus, receive the grace to be zealous in searching for God. In the name of Jesus, receive the wisdom of God. Amen. Can you share God's love by subscribing to this YouTube channel and sharing or discussing this message with others? The
Subscription is free. And the icon for subscription is at the bottom corner of the right side of the video. May Almighty God bless and protect you with the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen.